Hello, what's good? It's your gal bunny pot. So, Twitch has given me affluent, which means that I now have subscribers, which is a weird feeling. Uh, I have thought about doing a Patreon in the past. The reasons why I haven't is I didn't really feel like um, committing to like big monthly things and like letting people down and stuff like that. And I wanted to kind of work at my own pace, but I've been doing streams regularly enough that I feel confident that I can keep up with, yeah, to make some content for my subscribers. Um, these videos will all go out to everybody um, after a probably like two week period, but subscribers will get it a little bit earlier. So if you really like what I do and you want to see it first thing, then you can jump on board and subscribe. Uh, and that's all through Twitch, so not through YouTube yet. As you can probably tell from the video description, I am doing a Pokemon Red Nuzlocke run. Um, I'm sure most people know what a Nuzlocke run is now, but uh, for those who don't, it is a modified way of playing Pokemon. Um, there is a separate rule set for doing so. Um, the general premise around a Nuzlocke run, run is that if a Pokemon faints, I have to release it from the PC and it's gone forever. So I Pokemon cap one, ready to catch some Pokemon, do the thing or I like flip it back, throw the, throw the Pokemon. Um, so I will go over the rules first. Uh, so the first rule, rule number one, uh, any Pokemon that faints is considered dead and must be released. So I, basic premise of a Nuzlocke run, um, yeah, if it faints it's gone forever. I don't know if I'll be able to finish this game. If we run out of Pokemon, we just have to stop. And like that's, that's that. That's, th that's the run. Rule two, uh, nicknames are mandatory, so always got to name your pets. Uh, rule three, only catch the first Pokemon encountered in each area and none else. If the Pokemon encountered is faints or flees, there are no second chances. So uh, Griffin plays this mode on his Nuzlocke run. Basically, yeah, if we encounter an Abra, the first Pokemon we see that we enter a new route, and it teleports immediately, and we miss it, that is it. We do not get another Pokemon in that route. That is going to be a big deal, because we need, like, early game, we're going to need enough Pokemon to deal with Brock and Misty, and oh my god, if we are not getting grass Pokemon, we're going to be in trouble. Fourth rule is no potion use in battle. Uh, and rule five, and this is even harsher around those no potion rules is battle style is set to set. In game that basically means that um, after you faint an enemy Pokemon, say it's a leader or a trainer, um, they switch out to the next Pokemon. Normally in the game it's pretty forgiving and you're allowed to switch as well, but um, on set mode you're not given that prompt. Yeah, we don't get an opportunity to switch Pokemon without a taking hit. Ooh. Oh, this is scary. I sure hope we are able to get somewhere with this or have a good time failing really hard, but first attempt, let's have a go into the game. Here we go. <sighs> this startup, I swear to goodness. I wonder if I still have my visual, my uh, Game Boy Advance lying around. It'd be really cool to like see what this is like. It looks so much like richer through the capture software, but um, yeah. Fire Red. What are their importance? Wait. Can just go next. Yep. And how to, oh my god, did it really have this tutorial? I'm back on a grand adventure with you as the hero. Speak to people and check things whenever you go. 
being in town for a decade, gather information and hints from every source. Not the internet. Do your own research. Mm. You, at times you'll be challenged by others and attacked by wild creatures. Be brave and keep pushing on. This is really lovely. I don't remember any of this. Through your adventure we hope that you'll interact with all sorts of people and achieve personal growth. That is our biggest objective. Wow. That's a really heartwarming message. And we have Professor Oak. Yes, I have no problem sending a ten-year-old out into the wilderness with wild animals everywhere. <laughs> Hello there, glad to meet you. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. Was he not a professor in this one? The Pokemon professor. He is a professor, of course. This world is inhabited far and wide by creatures called Pokemon. And this Nidoran that I have for some reason as an example. Like, basic ass Pokemon rat. <laughs> Some people Pokemon are pets, others use, it, others use them for battling. As for myself... <laughs> I train them for my own dark desires! <laughs> See you later, Nidoran. Wink. But first, tell me a little bit about yourself. Are you a boy or are you a girl? Whoa. And, of course, look at that babe, how can we not be a girl in the Pokemon universe? Like, all the outfits are just, like, fucking killer. Let's begin with your name. What is it? Let's see. You know we gotta go bunny pot. Oh, jeez. Bunny pot. Oh. Oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. We can, we can work with this. We'll just go bunny. But we always have to go with. Oh my god, they don't have the stars and stuff. Bunny! Like we're screaming it every time. I'm happy with that. Right, so your name is Bunny! Yes, it must be yelled every, every opportunity. This is my grandson. He has a knapsack and cargo pants and a polo shirt. And a dog tag? Who the fuck is this dude? He's been your rival since you were both babies. Oh yeah, I know that guy. What was his name? Kaz. Kaz! <laughs> they played us like a damn fiddle. <laughs> What's our name? What's, what do we name our rival? Hmm. Hmm. Okay. That's like a really rich boy name. Like the sort of guy who would wear a polo shirt and dog tags. Hmm. My name is. My name is Tofer. That's right. I remember now. His name is- I'm reminded of the, like, series Dollhouse. Like, the- the nerd from that. Just being, like, a little bit... Maybe arrogant... Bunny! Your very own Pokemon legend is about to unfold. A world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon awaits. Let's go. Oh boy. Shrink Ray. Alright, what is- what consoles does this one have in the bedroom? Bunny played with the NES. Okay, it's time to go. It's crammed full of Pokemon books. It's still crammed full of Pokemon books. Same thing. It's a nicely made dresser. It will hold a lot of stuff. We all know all this stuff, but I just want to like check it out. Bunny booted up the PC. What would you like to do? Item storage, mailbox. 
There's no mail here. Wah wah, you have no friends. Turn off. Okay. Now, before I forget, we will open up the options menu. We will... Hmm, battle style... Oops. We'll set the battle style to set. One. Oh, this is the border. Oh, we have the classic one. Hmm. What are we feeling like? Oh man, these are all cute. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna rock the classic one for a bit, just because it's like, oh, you know, I don't know, it's kind of what they were going for. I love this. I love this cute little hat. It's it's kind of it's kind of cute. It's a it's a look. It's certainly a look. <laughs> okay. What? Let's see. What's this thing on the wall? It's a first to notice. If you're confused, ask for help. Press the L or R button. I'm okay, thank you. I know how to play Pokemon. Oh, this is a house. What, what are you watching, Mum? There's a movie on the TV. A girl with her hair and pigtails is walking up a brick road. I better go. <laughs> is that the Wizard of Oz? Mum, right. All girls dream of traveling. It's set on TV. I think you'll find all girls uh, dream of traveling the traveling the world, doing wild animal death sports. But you know, traveling the world is a good way to put it. Next, I was looking for you. Thanks, mom. See you later. Goodbye forever, I guess. Bunny's house. Bunny, you have to yell it. Bunny's house. Um, his house is next door. Mom said next door, but this is, this is Jackface's house. That's okay, that's okay. Da, da, da. Okay. We all know this part. Mm. Turfa. What? It's only Bunny. Gramps isn't around. Those are Pokeballs. They contain Pokemon. Did I... Did I miss Professor Oak? God, I haven't played this game forever. I can't remember. It's like an encyclopedia, but the it's pages are blank. Do I have to talk to one of these? No, 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 no. I think, I think I have to leave the town. I think that's what... And then he comes up and kicks my ass. Hey, wait, don't go out. You're not my dad. It's unsafe. Wild Pokemon live in tall grass. You need your own Pokemon for your own protection. I know, here, come with me. Gramps, I'm fed up with waiting. God, he's such a shithead. Just chill out for two seconds. You fucking loser. Tofa, let me think. Oh, that's right. I told you to come. Just wait. Here, bunny! There are uh, three Pokemon here. The Pokemon- Haha! <laughs> Haha! <laughs> the Pokemon are here. The Pokemon are held inside these Pokeballs. When I was young, I was a serious Pokemon trainer. But now, in my old age, I only have these three left. You can have one. Go on, choose. No fair. Hey, Gramps, no fair. What about me? What about my Pokemon? Be patient, Tofu. You are. You need to check your pri privilege, young man. You can have one too. But you have to wait. It's called equality, and it helps those not afforded the opportunities a chance to get a leg up. Um, okay, so there's a way to do this, I think. Uh, so let's have a look. Um, part of the imposed Nuzlocke rules say that you have to base your Pokemon's... Let me just pause right here. Okay. Um, part of the self-imposed Nuzlocke rules say that you base your first Pokemon off the last digit on your ID. So for 1, 2, 3, you have to pick Bulbasaur. For 4, 5, 6, we're going to play with Charmander. On 7, 8, 9, we're going to pick... 
scuttle or zero is run as trace. So what do we have? Um, oops. Wrong button. So what do we have? Bunny. Bunny! Ooh, nine. Okay, so last number is a nine. That means we get Squirtle, which is my favorite anyway. So. Oh no, not Charmander. So, Bunny, you're claiming the fire Pokemon Charmander? No. Oh yeah, Squirtle is your choice. It's worth raising. Hell yeah! Squirtle Squad! This Pokemon is really quite endogenic. Bunny Bunny received the Squirtle from Professor Oak. There's so many capitalized words in this game. Do you want to give it a nickname? Always. Oh man, what are we gonna put? What are we gonna call my my good good Squirtle boy? Okay, I already had a name prepared for this one. <laughs> oh, not that. Uh, T. Tut. Your friend in mine, Tut Squat. Tut Squat. Tut and Squat. It's probably better than something like Spit Lizard, which is probably what I was gonna add, but you know, that's fine. I'll take this one then, because it counts as yours, and I'm a fucking asshole. Okay. My big one looks like tough than yours. Yeah. Funny that. Asshole. Wait, Bunny, let's check out our Pokemon. How embarrassing would it be if I lost this fight? Oh boy. Well, this is before type advantage really matters too much. Oh, damn, this fucking song there. Banger! Da -da 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 -da. Rumble Topus and out Bulbasaur! God damn it, Bulbasaur is so fucking cute. Tatsquat! Oh, for Pete's sake, so pushy as always. <laughs> Fighting in my lab. Bunny! Murder my grandson! You never had a Pokemon before, have you? A Pokemon battle. I've had a Pokemon battle before. Huh? This is New Game Plus. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. So as far as I can see, these these are always just like do tackle. <laughs> I probably should lower its defense there, huh? Oh my god, am I gonna fucking die? Oh my god, stop being so aggressive, you piece of shit. Don't do it. Ah, oh, there we go, crit. <laughs> Thank you, RNG. That would have been embarrassing. Ted Squirt gains her. Oh, too, 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 too off. 69. That is almost nice. Ted Squirt grew to level 6. I probably should have paid more attention to those stats. What? Unbelievable. I picked the wrong crook. <laughs> Do over. Wah. Funny, got 80 poker yanny for winning. I'm just gonna call it poker yanny. If you win, you earn prize money and your Pokemon will grow. Battle of the trainers and make your Pokemon strong. Tofa, okay, I'll make my book one battle. Yeah, okay. Blah blah blah. Okay, no, that's probably gonna do it for the episode, I think. Um, this has already gone like 20 minutes long, so I'm trying to keep them short. Oh, okay, okay, here we go. This is I rest this, let's, let's do this. I am Bunny Pot and I love you a bunny lot. Mm, no, okay, that's too cringy. It's a work in progress. We'll, we'll, we'll figure something out. <laughs> Bye.